Limited is a business that supplies hardware and a software service specifically for helping train sailors. We also use that same technology to supply um, supply places like animation research with trackers to be able to go out and track their sailing goods for, for television graphics. It's a cloud-based service that holds data, deals with the security of, of people's data and we um, share that out over the internet. Currently we have Copper that's one meg up and ten meg down and we are in the process of putting UFB into it. We are in a building that was built in 1905 and added on to 1920 so part of that is, is getting, getting wire through the, the thin, very thick walls. We are an internet-based company, so everything we do is, is delivering our service over the internet. We have customers who are collecting data from their, their sailors while they're out on water and training, so they're effectively the GPS unit, but it also gets biometric information from the sailors. All of that data is sent live up to our servers, and then from that point we can share the data back out to different people, there's security around who gets to see that data, but it's all delivered over the internet, so everything we do is internet-based. We're fairly lucky that a lot of the data we send is, is small data, so having a faster or getting rid of the latency is our first major issue. Um, bandwidth isn't such an issue for us, but what I'm hoping it does will create a more vibrant infrastructure around us. So having other businesses who do similar things to us being around us is, is a great asset and help to actually help us learn and help us be smarter about the way we do things. It's kind of more of a, a big ecological thing around us, not just us. Dunedin currently has a university and polytech, and we get a lot of our, our staff from that. So Dunedin's a smart city in that sense. Um, what I think will really help Dunedin is being more relevant on, on a global scale, more relevant even within New Zealand. So the smart people who come out of those institutions realise that there is there's clever business here, there's, there's smart stuff already happening in the city and it's, it's being relevant to them to be able to think it's worthwhile staying. If Dunedin won Gigatown, that would be a great marketing tool to help us be relevant on a global scale, on a national scale, and it would just be cool.